Hello everyone, my name is Tash and I am a student from Asia Solution. So today we are going to learn to make this robot. So let's see how it works. <laughs> So how it works let us make it let us start making the body of the robot to start we'll take a cardboard which I've cut into a house shape and I have already covered it with white paper now we are going to fold it and now we are going to release it just like this now let us attach the other parts of the robot. Now we are going to stick the motors with a double sided tape like this. The wire part should be inside just like this. To hold the cardboard stiff I have cut a small piece of cardboard and attach it with double sided tape just like this. I have took a 2 meters black wire. We have to take all the black wires and twist them. Just like this. Now let us attach the tires. Now we'll take a bottle cap and we'll stick it the, on the tail of the robot. Just like this. And we'll draw a face like this. Now I've drew the face and now I'm going to take the 2 meters red wire and attach it to the motor red wire. Now we are going to twist it and you have to do this to the second motor. Now we will keep the robot aside and we will start making the controller. For the remote controller we will cut a shape as the remote controller and we will cover it with a white paper. Now we will use a copper tape to make the tracks. And please pay attention because this is the important part. First I will do the tracks and show you the connection. I have took two copper tapes and stick it like this. And then we have to take a single copper tape that continues go from this side. And then just do a circle. And similarly do it on the other side. So it will look something like this. Remember you have continue it and do not cut it. Now we will keep this aside and we will go to the controller part. To start with I have used two copper tapes and a single copper tape which continues here. Make two such controllers for left and right. Now take two controllers and stick it to the remote. To do so we will take a double sided tape. And stick, it, stick the controller on the remote like this. And we'll bend it like this. See that the circles are making contact. Just like this. Do the same on the other side. So now our controllers will look like this. This is the front side and this is the back side. Now let's connect the robot wires to the remote. Now we'll take the both red wires from the motor and stick them on the remote like this. And secure it with a copper tape. Just like this. Now do the same on the other side just like this. 
Now it's time to connect the battery. I've took a 9 volts battery and stuck it like this. We will use a battery cap to connect it. Like this. Before we connect, we are going to make the battery cap connection. The negative of the battery cap is the black wire and the positive of the battery cap is the red wire. The black wire of the battery cap is connected to the robot black wire. Just like this, the positive of the battery cap is going to this line and it will be secured with a copper tape. Just like this. Now connect the battery cap to the battery. Just like this. Let us take our motor outside and let's see if it is working. Thank you everyone for watching this video. I hope you learned something new today.